Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Day 1. Pray that you may be a praying wife. Proverbs chapter 14 verse 1. The wisest of women builds her house, but fully with her own hands tears it down. Psalms chapter 46 verse 5. God is in the midst of her. She shall not be moved. God will help her when morning dawns. Acts chapter 1 verse 14. All these with one accord were devoting themselves to prayer, together with the women and Mary the mother of Jesus and his brothers. Prayer. Lord, I admit that some days I wish you'll just fix my marriage and I'll start with my husband. There are days when I feel he is the problem, when I wish he realized how much he frustrates me. Maybe if he realized this, he would change and our marriage will get better. But Lord, sometimes I wonder if he thinks the same things about me. God, the most powerful tool you have given us to improve our marriage is prayer. Help me bring my husband before you daily. God, I want to be a wife who acknowledges that her husband deserves her prayers. He deserves a wife who continually intercedes on his behalf, not so that you will fix him, but so that you will bless him, walk beside him, and know what is most important to his heart. God, no matter what my prayer life was like when my husband and I first fell in love, Help me see the purpose and the power in praying now. You are so faithful to answer when we call. And right now, I just place my marriage at your feet. Continue to guide me as I remember what it means to be a praying wife. Help me choose to walk in love always. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Daily generational prayer of blessing for you and your husband. May the Lord bless you and show himself real to you. May the Lord keep you and put a hedge of protection around you. May the Lord make his face shine on you and light your life with the fullness of his glorious character. May the Lord be gracious to you and show his saving power to you. May the Lord lift up his countenance on you and show how pleased he is with you. May the Lord give you his peace and bring you his wholeness. May you grow deeper in love with each passing day as you grow deeper in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. May your marriage fulfill the purpose that God intended it to. May you walk out the call of God on your lives individually as a couple. May your children, finances, and your endeavors be blessed by God and bring Him glory and honor. May your marriage and home be a house of prayer, a house of worship, a house of joy, and a small heaven. This is my prayer for you and the generations to follow. In the strong and mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Amen.